The Technical University of Kenya is one of the main vocational training institutions in the country. As one of the leading education centers, the university attracts a large number of student enrollments. These large numbers have, however, put a strain on the institution's limited learning resources. But a recently launched project between AVIC International and the Kenya government to supply state-of-the-art equipment to vocational institutions in Kenya is gradually having an impact on the learning process. Before the equipment, we still had some equipment, but they were not sufficient enough. This lack of equipment in the past sparked criticism that most graduates from these institutions were unqualified for the demands of the job market. The collaboration between AVIC International and these institutions offers a platform for practical learning and for students to embrace technical skills development. As you can see here, we have about 21 sets of CNC machines. In the other lab also we have another set of conventional machines that came in through this collaboration. While on a tour of the Institute, AVIC International Chairperson and Chief Executive said that through the collaboration with Kenyan institutions, AVIC International would share the industrialization experience of China and add to the local culture. Kenya is a young country. Kenya is a young country with more than 70% of its population aged under 35. These young people are in urgent need of vocational training. Kenya's Vision 2030 aims to transform the country into a newly industrializing middle income country. To realize this also requires a number of youth qualified with professional skills. Seeing China's experiences in the development of past decades and also in vocational education, we found that skills in mechanics as well as electronic and electric fields are the most important in industrial development. That's why we want to cooperate with the Kenyan side. Beyond the mechanical equipment, AVIC International is also offering vocational skills training in the hope that it will improve the job skills of the local youth and promote the combination of production and learning. With this, we are able to make a wide array of uh, basically parts. We can make spare parts for vehicles, we can make spare parts for plants. Basically plants inclu it includes factories. Sometimes you may have a broken down part that needs maintenance or replacement. We can come and do it here. So basically we are talking, we can, you name it, you see a part, we can do it. With these machines, right now, I'm able to design something. I am able to design something using a software. This is solid come apart and I generate the codes and come machine it in using the same, same, same machines. Well, so far, about 92 mechanical engineering machines have been installed in this technical institution. And thanks to the partnership between AVIC and Kenya, the students here are now able to locally manufacture such products. These products could soon be exported to other countries, a major milestone in actualizing Kenya's Vision 2030. Susan Mungeli, CCTV in Nairobi, Kenya.